Hello all, welcome to Netbook and welcome back to MuleSoft Tutorials. So in our previous session, uh, I have teached about um, how we can install uh, AnyPoint Studio and sign up for the Cloud app. Then the next uh, part was about overview of AnyPoint Studio. Today I'm planning to show how we can implement a simple hello world program in a mule soft what is hello world so any technology if you are going to learn the basic thing is people say that hello world program if you go with the java javascript or maybe any technology or maybe html also first people learn about hello world what is about hello world it is kind of a simple basic program you know printing one hello world message that is what it is hello world so in emulsoft what is mean by that so if i go to the browser and say uh, local host colon some port number i will give slash say um, message when i say enter i want to see over here hello world as a message how we can achieve that in a mule soft so currently it is showing that the site cannot be reached right so because of i haven't implemented anything to display that message so in a mule soft i want to accept this url and give response in a browser or maybe in a uh, any any application if whoever is accessing this URL they should get a message hello world that is a requirement right so hope you understood the requirement so I want to construct you know to accept this URL in a soft then return a message over here hello world that is a requirement now that how I can achieve in a soft so this is the AnyPoint Studio, which will be used for implementing MuleSoft applications, right? So I'm going to create a, a Mule project over here, create a Mule project. I can give some name over here, hello world, okay? App or API. I'm going to give a name as hello world API and click on finish over here by selecting the runtime I have default is selected 4.3.0 so this is the the initial flow has been created over here sorry initial configuration file has been created over here now I want to implement that logic to accept this URL and return back the response as hello world that I need to achieve in the mule soft First of all, the requirement is to accept this URL. What is this URL? Just copy paste over here. You can see this URL is starting with HTTP. That means this should accept a HTTP request, right? So my application should accept HTTP request. That means my application should listen, my application should listen HTTP protocol right now if i go to the here and we can see there is something called over here http module in the mule soft so i want to listen this url right so i can use http listener over here to listen http request this is my http request this url to listen that request i'm keeping HTTP listener over here. Now, I kept HTTP listener, but how my application knows it should listen only this URL or this host and port number. So I need to configure that in a mule soft. So over here, when you select, there is a connector configuration. Click on place over here. And if you see, I have given over here HTTP, right? So I will 
teach about HTTPS later. That is a secure HTTP. The host name is localhost, right? So I can use the host name, the default one 0.0.0, .0 or you can use a local host here. Anything is fine. So I'm going to use 0.0.0. .0 .0. So in any machine, if you are going to deploy, this can be accessible with a, the machine's host name, if we keep it this one. Then the next one is the port number. The port number is, I need to configure 8081. So by default, the MuleSoft port number is 8081. That is what I'm giving. I'm not going to explain about the remaining all options over here. We will talk about it those later. Okay. So. I just given protocol host name port number click on OK. Now there is a path. If you see my URL, there is a path. This is called as a path over here. I can give that path over here. That's it. We have configured a HTTP listener to accept this HTTP URL request. Now what is the next? we want to return a so this message url whatever it is coming will be accepted that is what i have implemented here and i want to return a response with a hello world this is the message i want to return as a response so this is the message i want to return right so how i can do that in mulesoft if we go to the favorites you can use set payload a transform message to construct a message okay so I'm going to use a set payload over here okay and put it over here and here you can see the value is payload over here but I want to return hello world as a string over here as a response right so I'm just giving that hello world so in the browser, if I want to show as it is, I can use a mem type that is application slash JSON from the drop down over here. Otherwise, what will happen whenever I enter this request, a Java message will be returned in the uh, in the browser and it will be downloaded a message with uh, some kind of a file. So you need to open and see. So instead of that, I want to display over here. The JSON message can be displayed over there. That's why I just given that application slash JSON. So this is the set payload is used for a constructing a message in the MuleSoft. That's it. My simple requirement is done. Now, can I click this URL and test it? No, nothing is displayed over here. You can see this site cannot be reached. Why? I just implemented a solution, but why it's not working? The reason is you just implemented. You need to run this application, right? Then only your application will work. What is mean by run? The run is something you need to deploy this application in somewhere. Where? This is the Mule application. You can deploy it in only in Mule runtime. Now I want to deploy this application in Mule runtime so that I can use this application and test it from here. Sorry. Right. So let's deploy this application. How I can deploy this application? Right click on this application. Go to the run as Mule application. Click on that. It will deploy this application in a Mule runtime. So let's wait for that. You can see this is Mule Home and it is trying to deploy this application in our Mule runtime. Uh, run so let's wait for deploying this application. It will take a minute or a couple of minutes. That's it. So you can see this is initializing your Hello World application. Uh, yes, you can see now my application has been deployed successfully. Hello World API. And the status is deployed. Whenever you see that status is deployed, that means your application is running properly in a Mule runtime. Now go back to the uh, browser, localhost, 
colon 8081 slash uh, message right that is what i have given path when i enter now you can see immediately you can see that hello world as a response that simple it we need to understand is we need to accept this http url and return a response to listen that url we use http listener to return that message we use set payload over here that simple it is mulesoft hello world program keep learning i will be coming up with a new topic in the next session this is the just starting off so you just started the journey of mulesoft development thank you for watching this video please like share subscribe my channel see you in the next video thank you bye